Hello guys, this is Zuma, and welcome back to episode 6 of The Forest. So in this episode, what I want to do is try and start my base, or at least put down the base for my base. Because um, we've got a treehouse, so we can jump into that anytime the cannibals come and disturb me as I'm trying to build this thing. So I'm just trying to figure out where my base is actually going to go, or how big it's going to be. Because I definitely think I want to go from my base into my treehouse. Or is it better to put my treehouse a little bit separate so if I'm on the outside then I can just climb up the rope and then jump into my base hmm I'm just trying to think of the best way to do it or I could probably put like a tr another tree ledge is it called a tree ledge I can't remember what it is let me just have a look there's something you can put on the tree that is not a tree house it's just like a, pla a tree platform there we go I think it's going to be a tree platform where is it um. Ah, huh. yeah, tree platform. So let's just see what this does. It does join. So, okay, that's that's pretty good. So, open if this goes into my base, and then that stays on the outside. So I have two ways in. Is that is that flat? I think that is that good enough. Okay. So then my wall. It'll be like here, going through. And this will just be inside it. I think I can jump from that platform to that platform. But that is 14 logs. Damn. <laughs> That's quite a bit. Oh, and um, one thing that we need as well is some rabbits to make a rabbit pouch to get some blueberries to finish this damn archery target, which is annoying. So I'm just going to go and check this rabbit cage to see if we've got anything. We struck out last time. Uh, yeah, struck out again. Okay, I think I'm going to have to put some more rabbit traps somewhere. But that's a bit more better than here. So I keep striking out. But anyway. Okay, so are we going to build this or shall I put down the foundations for my base first? Okay, let's see what we can do. So I haven't built anything in a long time. I haven't used this new building system yet. I don't know, I don't really know how it all works yet. What's a platform? Okay. Oh, you can, no way you can go as high as you want. Oh, that is so much easier. Before you had to like do it in little tables and go up. Okay, what else can we do? Um, custom foundation, infinity logs. I don't like the sound of that. Infinity? Uh, flooring? That's a circle. And I can't put it down. Okay. Custom foundation. Okay, this is just a long log. What the hell? No. Oh, that is so much easier. That is so much easier. I imagine the more I go though, the more logs it's going to be, so I have to be quite careful how big I make this thing. Okay. Right, now I know how that works. So, I want this to be on the outside, and this to be on the inside. So let's start with that. So, where to put it? This is the cave. Oh, the rope that you can go down to the cave, so I don't want to be over that. I don't want that in my base. Screw that. Okay, so it's going to be from this tree here pretty much so there and then we're gonna go I want to keep this inside my base I hope this works I really hope this works so we're gonna go what oh, all right might as well go in line with this tree oh, I should try and keep the berry bush oh it's a bad berry bush we don't want bad berry bushes in our base all right so I need to make sure that's lined up that's the most important thing like that Oh, this is going to be quite high as well. Okay, this this is going to be... Oh, dear. Wow. Okay, zoom out. Is that going to be too big? Let's just put it down and then see. So I want it to be in some sort of a square. Holy shit, this is huge! That's what she said. All this feels kind of final. Is that in line? Is that in 
I can't even tell if that's straight or not. Oh, I don't know. Right, and then let's go back. Oh, I don't want to fall down there. Oh, this is so weird. I think... Have we done it? Come on. Is that snapping? <gasps> it does! Hey! Wow! No way! That's 74 logs! That is not that bad, considering that the whole treehouse was 31 or 32 logs. Wow. Okay, and that does go into my base. In fact, I can probably jump up there. <laughs> it's that high. I wasn't expecting this to be so far off the ground. Okay, looks like we've got a lot of construction to do. And then my door's probably going to be about here. Or is it worth actually putting my door on this side? So I come out into the nice little garden that I have. It does feel quite pleasant outside here. Huh. For some reason, I always start to put my door like this side to see the plane, but who wants to look at this thing? It's not very nice. No one wants that in the front garden, so maybe, yeah. I could put the door at the front. Okay, and that is on the outside, so that is good, so I can still climb up this. In fact, I could probably jump from that treehouse into my base, but at least we've got that. Okay, time to do some tree deforestation. Let's start this thing. And now I don't care if any cannibals come because I can just jump in my treehouse and I have uh, Molotovs at the ready. If you didn't watch last episode, it was a Molotov cocktail pie. <laughs> I, uh, I definitely got those cannibals good. No. I liked it before when I could push it in the direction that I wanted the tree to fall. It made things a lot easier. Right, let's start this beautiful thing. That's it. Roll towards my base. And so it begins. You, so, you can sort of get a scale of how big I want my final base to be. Oh, if you're wondering what that thing is on my wrist, that is deer skin. It's going to keep me warm at night time. Why don't I pick two logs up there? Oh, this is going to be awesome. I'm actually waiting for anything to glitch out. I don't know why. I just expect something to go wrong. But this is just the base. This isn't no walls or anything. It's going to be fun. I probably should drink a soda because my energy is quite low. There you go, buddy. You can swing like a champion. Oh, will you fall? The right way once. Why is it only four logs? I'm only getting four logs from a damn tree. Damn. Never mind. It just means we need to chop down more trees. Oh, you're a biggie. Still don't know if these trees respawn or not. I don't know. I've got an idea. Maybe I should put a rabbit trap down and then cause that takes a lot of sticks and then just grab these sticks and then build two things at once. Cause I might as well pick up the sticks if they're next to me. Oh, okay, I'll pick one from here. Okay, I'm gonna put another rabbit trap down. I don't even know if the rabbits are near here. Right, so we've done 10 already. Hmm. Because this rabbit trap is not good. Does it keep on going? Am I, am I actually collecting rabbits? <laughs> Hello, little bird. I don't think I am. I can't see no rabbit carcasses around or rabbit fur or anything. Okay, so I'm not collecting rabbits from there. I think it'd say. Hmm, damn it. Okay, I'm going to put a rabbit thingy down here. What's it called? Animal trap. There we go. This better be a good location. Might as well grab some sticks as I'm building all this. 
There we go. Sweet. Oh, he had ten sticks on me. Oh, so we're getting the, the outside frame done first. <laughs> this is cool. My guy's a damn freaking architect or something. Here we go. You will do. Oh, did I have any more logs around? Yeah, I thought I did. I have no idea where this other log has rolled to. Oh. Hello there. Cannibals must be sleeping. And I'm pretty sure that only the little golem ones come out through the daytime. I'm like 90% sure because I've never seen the leaders through the day. So it's really good just to build through the day and not at night. Okay. Oh. I need some food. Oh, some sticks. Pick them up from my animal trap. This looks like it's going to fall the right way. I can feel it. Uh, no. Wrong way again. Exactly the wrong way. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. In fact, I want these to follow me because I've still got... I'm oh, stuck on. Come on. I've still got my large effigy at the back. Here we go. I need three heads. So if I can find these little golem things, I might be able to finish my effigy. Here, golem, golem. I know you saw me. Come on, get Zuma's flesh. Free flesh. Freshly prepared. Can't get much fresher. Huh. Must have scared him off. Right, where was that tree that I chopped? There we go. Don't want them to hit me as I'm carrying these logs. That's probably what they'll do. Get a good cheap shot in. I have to, I have to walk into the middle of it for some reason. It's quite good that this is raised because the cannibals won't be able to jump on top of it. Uh, get two more. Yes. Pick it up. There we go. I have got the render distance set on high. But for some reason it comes stuff comes in so close. It's like, look at that bush. There, that's the render distance. In, out. I've got it set on max as well. That's probably the way the game's meant to be. Probably like an optimization problem. I really, really do want those golems to come back. Am I chopping this? Is that a... Okay. That's a sure tree. That's what we call that. Ones that you can't chop down. I guess it does make sense because you just wouldn't want no trees in the forest, so that's fine. There's still plenty of trees to chop down. Come on, man, she's going down so quick. These trees are a lot taller than before and you get less logs. I don't understand how that works. When I say before, I mean in the earlier patches. Come on. We've done 19. We out here. Just chopping down trees. Building shit. Living the good life. Oh. Hey, buddy. There is two. Little shit. <laughs> Come here. Oh. Oh! The buff hitting me! Oh, you sneaky devils! 
Oh! 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 <laughs> I dropped a soda. I need energy. I was gonna retreat to my treehouse then. Holy shit, that was close. That was close. <laughs> right, where's this other guy? I need armor. I'm playing with fire here. I need armor. I don't know why I haven't been collecting it. It's because I ain't seen no lizards. If I can find some lizards. <laughs> oh, dear. oh, Zuma, you are one lucky duck. Okay. Your energy goes down so fast. I can't believe that. I nearly died. Oh, there's some logs over there. It's gonna get dark soon. Oh, yes. Perfect. Yeah, definitely getting dark. Oh, I dropped a log. Twenty one. There is still another golem out there somewhere. And it is getting dark, so the leaders are gonna come out soon. Now that is gonna be fun if I'm still building while well, there's gonna be these big cannibal leaders running around after me. It's gonna make the job so much harder. I'll get the rest of these logs and then We'll try and sleep and see if I can bypass the night time. That's a good idea. Alright, we're over a third of the way there. So this should make it a brand new day. <laughs> Look at my little deer rug. Maybe it's that small because you can put loads attached together and make it a big rug. I don't know. But, uh, right, let's see if we can skip the night time. That's quick. That's better, it's a bit more bright. Wow, this foundation is quite big, actually. <laughs> oh. Right, let's get back to work. 30 logs out of 74. Nearly halfway there. Right, this should be the animal trap complete. Oh! Two off. Give me two sticks, please. Yay! Right, catch me a rabbit. <laughs> please, I need a rabbit. Where's my other thing that don't work? Okay, that's got none in. Like, I was expecting any rabbits to be in there. Rabbits are smart, man. <laughs> they are smart creatures. Oh, my animal traps are shit. Right, let's try hitting it from this side and see if it falls away from me towards my base. It's got to work somehow. You need to be able to manipulate the way the drop. No. Alright, I think it's totally random. Wait a minute, does it keep dropping to my right? Okay, we'll try something. If I can make these logs fall where I want them to, that'll be so much easier. I'll make uh, building a lot quicker as well. So if I hit this tree this way, then it should fall towards my base. Unless it's totally random. Because I am hitting it. It does make sense because I'm taking the trunk out from the right side. So it would fall to the right. But it probably won't. <gasps> oh! Okay, that makes life a lot easier. <laughs> That might have just been a one-off though, so we'll keep trying that. 40 logs! We got 40 logs! 
I know it doesn't save that much time rolling towards my base, but it's something. And if I can make them drop in this big open area, it's easier to see the logs. Much easier. 46. That is a lot of timber. Right, we'll make a target for 50 this episode, and then we will finish it in the next one. Because that is a big foundation to get down. If we can complete it in the next episode and we can start building the walls. I'd also I need to chop up that golem as well. Because I'm three heads away from finishing the large effigy. So I will be two heads after that golem. There we go. Have some refreshments. It's been a long day at work. Actually, my guy's just surviving. He's not getting paid for this. So it's been a long day surviving. <laughs> I should have turned to the left more already gone in my base. <laughs> Damn it. Come on, you big ox. Look how big these logs are, and you can just carry them with ease. So, what's this? 48. Two more! In fact, how many's left on this tree? Log number 49. Where's log number 50? There we go. Oh, oh, oh yeah. It'd be nice to go up top and see how much we've actually done. Sweet. 50 logs down. Oh, it's doing this bit. Can I jump on it? Oh, it's going to look so good. Wow. Right, okay. Let me chop up the body if it's still there. Yeah. I thought it might spawn out. Need the head first. I know this is only a small axe, but you thought... Maybe like two or three swings, but it's like 15 swings. <laughs> oh, did the blood always come out like that? One head. I've got two more heads needed. I don't think it'll take the arm. I think we tried that before. Yeah. I've already got some arms. Oh, nice. Have I got legs? Got arms, legs, yeah. Ugh. I probably should build. In fact, that's what I'm going to do. Where is it? Effigies. I might as well make a leg effigy as well. I don't want these body parts going to waste. That seems so strange to say out loud. If someone's listening to this commentary from outside or something, they'll probably think I'm chopping bodies up. Right. Arm effigy. Oh, it is an arm effigy. I thought it was a leg effigy. Okay, arm effigy. It's like a, hey, effigy. Okay, so this one should be uh, over here. There we go. <laughs> All the arms. There we go, that's the body. Did I take both your arms, buddy? Damn. Oh no, there's one arm. <laughs> there we go. Can I see my effigy from here? I want him to be quite close. Yeah. That tree's in the way. Oh, it's not. I thought it might be a sure tree. Right, let's go and see the progress from our home. AKA Treehouse. Whoa. It looks like we're about 50% there, but obviously we've done the base, so we're more than that. We're three quarters of the way there, but we will finish it in the next episode. And I'm hoping to put down some walls as well, so we're probably going to be doing a lot more building. But hey guys, we hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, leave it a like rating, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching, guys, and take care.